Hello, everybody. Woo! So my name's Rachel. If you don't know me, I see a lot of family members here. Woo! Haven't talked to you in a while. <laughs> so, so um, I'm usually based in New York City, but um, due to the pandemic, I flew back to Texas, where um, I, like Texas, prefer to ignore my problems. Yes. So um, I also have been spending a lot more time with my family. And, you know, I've come to realize a lot of the traits that my family has passed down to me. So for example, I have my mom's eyes and her empathy and her sense of humor <laughs> and I have my dad's boobs. Um, so <laughs> I'm really grateful. And so since I've been living in New York City, I, I wrote a song about all the things I've learned. So here it is. I'm just a random girl here in New York City. I take big shits and I have small titties. <laughs> Here's a list of a bunch of rules. So listen up, you Zoom fools. AirPods drown out the screams of the homeless people. Blacks and the gays don't like being called the blacks and the gays. Blacks and the gays. Put chapstick on your lips and don't forget about the ones on your face. <laughs> don't hook up with a maintenance guy in your apartment building because then he'll just tell you that he wants to be friends and then he'll ghost you and then he has to fix your toilet because you clogged it. That was a few things that uh, I learned. Okay, my friend learned that in New York. Um, and so since I've been in Texas, I've been, you know, reminiscing a lot about all of the, my childhood memories. And I don't know if you guys had this at y'all's elementary schools, but uh, at my school, we had a horse girl. And that's the girl that would, you know, gallop around the playground, she would eat grass. And at my school, um, <laughs> that was me. <laughs> um, so you could be trying to speak English to me, and I would just be like, <sighs> <laughs> so I was really committed to the character and another thing that made me a little bit weird as a kid was that I had and I still have a lazy eye um and so it's like you don't always notice it but one of my eyes just tends to wander um wander off kind of like my dad did and um so I kind of feel like I look like that third special needs hyena from the Lion King <laughs> like, <laughs> um, that's just like my spirit animal. Um, it's really, it's really special to me. So, because it's a musical show, um, I'm going to play you another song about my lazy eye. Woo! Yeah. I'm a little distracted sometimes. I don't know what to do. One eye is looking one way, and the other is looking at you. When I'm drunk or tired, it gets even worse. I have been sentenced to an ophthalmological curse. Lazy eye, business technically. I don't know why you take the boys away from me. You took me from a five to a two. I would be a half price prostitute. Lazy eye, why was I born with you? Moment of silence. When I give a blowjob and I look up at the guy, everything's going so well, and then there goes my eye. 